Okay guys, welcome back to a brand new video. Now today we are going to be talking about something which I think is actually quite big and it's moving into arc 2 with the creatures. What creatures aren't going to be making it into the second game? Now I kind of agree with lots of this stuff. I've taken stuff from the community, from some friends as well. But Cedric put up a post and there's been lots of replies which we're going to be reading through today. I want you guys to let me know what your top 5 is as well but let's get in with today's video now as always if you do enjoy and you're excited for what's coming with arc over the next like i mean the next year is going to be crazy smash that like button subscribe if you're new around here it really does help me out and let's read through this now so this was a little bit ago but i wanted to bring it up again because i think it's quite a big point so Cedric, the lead community manager of ARK, uh, said, OK, so you know I don't do, like doing one-sided questions. On the other hand, what are your top five dinos you could do without in ARK 2? So there has been so many that came to my mind straight away. And you have to know that at the beginning of ARK 2, there's not going to be every single dino from ARK 1 into it because there's going to be new ones. They're going to, they want it to be fresh. They want it to be brand new. Of course, we're going to have the, you know, we already know there's going to be a Rex. There's going to be a Pteranodon. There's going to be some form of Bronto, which I actually think is the Brachiosaurus. Um, I've been talking about that for a while, but there's lots that aren't going to make it and new ones are going to replace it. So the first one, the first two, which for me, I just hate and I'm really sorry to say, I just in the game, they've given me so many problems is the Trudon and the Pego um, and the Itchy, actually. They're just, uh, you know, they're just them three have been my main problem. I know this is my opinion, so don't don't think that this is the, what's going to be happening. But let's go through this now. I'm looking forward to reading reading through your guys' top fives too. And uh, shout out to everyone who did, obviously, um, you know, that I sort of put in this video. So first one from Joker Gang, who put Trudon. So that's definitely, I agree with that. The Titan Bugs, that's what I've called them, but they're drones. Um, so the ants. Um, again, very annoying, but I do think there'll be some form of bugs that come to the game, um, you know, for the jungle and just that, that type of thing. The seagull thing, which I'm guessing is the itchy. Um, the Capuchius, again, the Capuchius. Uh, I, there's been a lot of votes for that. And then the sea scorpion thing, which I think is an ammonite, right? Am I, think, am I thinking of the right thing? I don't know. But either way, Joker Gang, you can let me know on Twitter. Shout out to you. So next one we have got from Kitty. Again, it's a follow, uh, fellow YouTuber that I follow. Um, said, that's a tough one. I'd have to say the seagull thing, um, which I'm hoping I'm right by saying um, the itchy, right? Uh, per, this is what I can never pronounce. Perlovia. Per, Perlovia. Per, per, Perlovia. Is that it? I'm going for that. But I'm, I think that's still wrong. You guys now get names wrong all the time. The Patchy, um, the Trudons, Piranhas. I'll probably get a lot of hate for this, but please keep the Pego. I love them. Oh, okay, so that's a different opinion. I can't stand it. I, I know when you tame a Pego, everything seems so much better. It's like, you know, when you at the beginning, you actually end up taming one. You're like, this thing's not all that bad. But at the beginning, oh, wow, the problems that this thing does cause. So there you go. That's Kitty's one. Then we have the, one of the largest. I think it, I think he is the largest ARC YouTuber right now. Um, it's changed a lot over the years. But Syntac, I think I speak for everyone here. Pego. Yep, shout out. Um, itch, well, itch, itch, ichthy, ichthy. That's why I, I think I pronounced it right, uh, wrong. I nearly, you know, you get um, mixed up with the names with the dolphin. Uh, Capruccius, Trudon, and Aberrant Raptors because they can still pounce and I keep forgetting. Micro Raptors too, shout. That is a big, big shout. I, Micro Raptors are very annoying too. Um, I'd rather not see them in Arc 2, personally. Um, that's a good list, I think. I don't... Um, a lot of people have put raptors, like aberrant raptors, I understand. I don't think aberrant raptors will be coming anyway um, because they won't... I don't think... I think it'll be a whole new change of, like, variant of dinos in the game. But, yeah, I just think raptors have, uh, you know, a main point of... Um, I mean, I'm not talking of that syntax point here. There's, like, another one later on, which is about raptors. And I just personally think they're the biggest, one of the most exciting dinos in the game. And there's so many different types of raptors. And, you know, just because of Jurassic Park and World over the years, you've got to have raptors in a game. Anyway, but not micro raptors. On to the next one. Stevie Lad, shout out to you. Be, uh, go check Stevie Lad out, actually. Great YouTuber. Has been doing, like, content 
for ages, like playthroughs and everything. And I've literally watched so many of his videos over the years. So he's gone for Pedo, uh, Pegos, um, uh, Lee, Lee Zikfies, uh, Itchionus, again, we all thought that, um, Micro Raptors and Trudons, all the annoying creatures. Pretty much what a lot of the community have said. I agree with this. Um, I don't mind, uh, yeah, I suppose. I don't. I, I feel like you need something in the ocean that is kind of gives you that fright factor. I guess that you know because I don't feel like the ocean has enough of that. Like you, I would love to see like a proper megalodon in the ocean in Arc Two, where you like that looks so realistic, and you know, with Unreal Engine Five, and can be so mad. You, you know what I mean? Um, but yeah next one so this one was kind of a bit of a it wasn't really a dino a dino question i just obviously liked what cedric's response was this person put could do without all of them it becomes everything but a dinosaur game and don't get me wrong i get that point um because when arc was first released uh to the community it looked like it was just generally a dinosaur game but cedric replied with i'm not sure it was ever a dinosaur game it was a survivor game with dinos in it um and that's kind of what a lot of us didn't understand at the beginning um but as the time went on it is you know it's just a pretty much a dinosaur it's pretty much a survivor game with dinos and unlimited op um you know opportunities but i do think that um it is obviously kind of a dinosaur game if someone said arc you want we want dinosaurs everyone loves dinosaurs on to the next one raptors this is i think this is the one so i mean at, in the end this person put they don't really mind them that much to be honest i understand the frustration that comes with raptors um maybe if they get rid of the pounce um uh but like in arc 2 that would be quite nice um pego Pelo, perlovia per, why do i keep seeing vr but no, yeah, something like that. I don't know. Trudon and the Ichion is Yeah, I think we're all going to say the same thing, aren't we there? Um, and then I think that is the final one. Brontos, Ammonites, Dodos, Compies, Mor Mor Morolo... I, this is another one I can't say. You, you guys know what they are, any. Uh, anyway, I, I think that was probably because they've got no perp, like pretty much no purpose in the game. But Dodos... Dodos. I mean, I know it's everyone's opinion, but we're never getting rid of dodos. Dodos are elite. The best dino in the game. Brontos will get, most likely be in the game. As I said, it might be the Brachiosaurus instead. Um, and then we have Ammonites. Kind of pointless. I suppose you can get a lot of um, resources from them, um, but they, they're never there when you need them. <laughs> um, dodos, again, no way. They're staying forever. We already know dodos are staying in Arc 2 from the trailer. Uh, Compies. I don't mind compies they're annoying but they're you know you can deal with them um and then obviously uh we'll go for the morella tops that's what i'm going for i i you know they're friendly they're friendly you know they leave you alone but again they are pointless in a way but i suppose they just sort of go around the beaches on arc just just be like i'm here you know um but yeah so let me know what you guys think about all of this like do you agree which ones do you not agree with what is your top five list and i'll favorite some of the ones in the comments so thank you very much for watching i thought this was a very big thing to talk about um just because it's so you know it's it's such a big thing like what's not going to be in arc two and uh what we never going to see again um so drop a like if you did enjoy subscribe if you're new to the channel and i'll see you guys in my next video